Statue Hunter 75 here with another awesome pickup that I got from the Boston Comic Con this past weekend. Not this statue, this statue I've had, but I'm finally reviewing it because I was waiting to get this piece to go with it. Um, let's review the statue real quick. It's uh, sculpted from DC Direct. It's sculpted by Tim Bruckner. It's designed by Jim Lee. It's based on the art of Jim Lee, which I'll get to after. But as you can see on the statue, this is such a cool statue. It's got like at the base Catwoman's whip. It's got poison ivies, like ivy on the gargoyle type thing. And just a great, amazing pick of Batman. This is from Hush, the Hush series. This is, uh, like I said, based on Jim Lee's Hush Batman art. And just such a great piece. I love this statue. It's uh, number 3,000. 724 of 6,000 made. So just to show you now, as you can see the statue, the artwork it was based on, I got it, I got it signed by Jim Lee. You can see the autograph by Jim Lee. And I'll even show you the picture of Jim Lee signing. I actually got a picture of him to prove it's authentic, of him, him and his wife there at the Comic-Con and he's signing this exact comic book. I actually had him sign another one the Batman 608 first print and the one that I'm signing right here to go with this statue is the Batman 608 second print which is a very rare uh, book a lot of people are trying to find this it's really hard to find but let's get back to the statue um, as you can see here designed by Jim Lee sculpted by Tim Bruckner and then there's the artwork that it's based on which I just showed you on the cover of the Batman 608 second print variant by Jim Lee from DC Direct. When I got this statue, the box was a little beat up, but I've got a great deal on this statue. So one quick spin around. This is Statue Hunter 75 with the DC Direct Jim Lee artwork version of Batman statue based on Jim Lee's artwork. Statue Hunter 75, signing up.